How is the thermal conductivity of liquid metal? When comparing liquid metal thermal paste to silicone-based thermal paste, which one is better? Liquid metal thermal paste typically uses gallium or similar metals. Unlike silicone-based thermal paste, liquid metal thermal paste does not use a medium, but rather directly fills the gaps between the CPU and the heatsink with metal. The all-metal composition makes them a better thermal conductor, with a thermal conductivity of up to 70 watts per meter Kelvin. However, liquid metal thermal paste also has electrical conductivity. This is usually not a bad thing, but if liquid metal thermal paste is accidentally smeared on the motherboard or other electronic components, it is likely to cause a short circuit and seriously damage other components. In addition, gallium reacts specifically with aluminum. If gallium is used as a liquid metal thermal paste and the CPU, heatsink or other components happen to be made of aluminum, the two will react and make the aluminum brittle and form an alloy. Silicone-based thermal paste is less risky, less expensive, and easier to apply. Although the thermal conductivity of silicone-based thermal paste is lower than that of liquid metal thermal paste, it is enough to make our computer perform at its best. Of course, the premise is to use a high-quality silicone-based thermal paste. So, what is a high-quality silicone-based thermal paste? Follow Cooling Monster for more information.